Hello guys, I hope you are doing really really well. In today's video, I am going to show you how to get Microsoft PowerPoint for free in your Samsung tablets. So guys, the tablet that I am using is Samsung Galaxy Tab S8 Plus. But the method that I will show you, it will work on all other Samsung tablets. So guys, first of all, you have to open your internet browser. So I go over here and I open my internet internet browser and here you have to open a website name of the website is powerpoint.new okay so you can see over here name of the website is powerpoint.new okay so once you uh, open this website okay I open this website so once you open it the PowerPoint page will be in front of you where you can make your slides you can make your presentations everything is in the ready form you can see over here all the tools are available over here you can see all your tools are available you have insert function draw design transition all your functions are over here guys if you see this page in front of you uh, if you open the powerpoint dot new you don't have to worry about just sign in with your microsoft account if you don't have microsoft account you can create a new microsoft uh, account uh, by just going over this option okay you see this create one option just select it and here you can create your account it is completely free so please note that this is an official web based version of microsoft power Point. so guys let's talk about different tools okay so we have all the tools available if I try to type something over here okay so I type slides for studies okay so you can see everything is working perfectly fine over here if I talk about uh, different tools so if you I go to the insert function you can insert new slides okay so I will just zoom it okay so you can see you can insert new slides okay and then if you want to create tables you can create tables over here and then uh, we have the pictures option you can create shapes icons smart art okay so all the tools available over here okay now if uh, I go to the design section you have different slides okay different design covers for you so you can see you can change the design as well then we have the transition it is important if you are giving your presentation then we have animations okay slideshow okay review view so you can see all tools are available and if you want to use your S Pen you can also use it uh, to write down something if you want to uh, if you want to uh, draw something you can also draw so you can see I can write on my slide with my S Pen okay uh, then we also have the highlighter option then I have the eraser option available over here as well so guys if you finish with your work you can also download a copy of your work all you have to do go into the file from here okay and then you see this option of save as and then here you can see you have the option of download a copy or download as PDF okay so for example I select download a copy okay so now it will ask me uh, if my presentation is ready I press download it start downloading and you can see my file is download so how I can access it I just have to go into my files okay and when I go into my files I go to downloads and here you can see my presentation is over here now I just uh, want to mention here one more thing all your work will be saved automatically into one drive okay so you can see it is written over here save to one drive you can access your one drive by selecting these dots from here okay so I will show you so these dots okay so if you select it okay you see it is showing you the one drive option so if you just select it it will open a new window like this where you have all your work okay so you can see my files over here and then recent work is over here so guys please note that it is giving you 5 GB of space in one drive so guys please note as this is a web based version so you always need an internet connection to use this okay 
okay now i just want to show you the function of share so if you see over here this is a share function so you can share your work with your friends with your colleagues okay so it has a lot of options so you allow them uh, to edit your uh, work so you can see anyone with the link can edit but if you don't uh, want them uh, to edit you just select this option and okay you just deselect this option from here okay so if you deselect it will be okay if you want to copy a link uh, just again select this share option and then you see copy link option is also available so you can just select this copy and then it will give you a link you can copy it and you can send it through any platform so guys if you want to see your uh, powerpoint dashboard you can also uh, you can also access it if you se select these dots from here just select it and then if you see over here powerpoint just select it and it will open uh, your powerpoint dashboard okay so all your presentation all your work is over here then you have the pinned option then you have the shared with me option available so all your work available over here and then you see these three dots over here uh, it is giving you different options you can open in browser add to pin open in app remove from the list open file location all uh, different functions available over here so guys i hope you like my video please subscribe to my channel guys keep learning and keep searching thank you very much